Peace and Gray Hell. This is Cal Local L. Dallas L. Bailey Bay with the More View Podcast. I just wanted to come. I haven't made a video. Oh man, about three weeks, three four weeks. Um, for whatever, for for different reasons, but I got to get more into teaching and educating, and not just opinionated things. But a lot of things that go on on a daily basis is so full of misinformation it would take me hours and hours to disseminate but i'm gonna disseminate this one real quickly now as a as a moorish american i can't vote for the united states um in any election um, because i'm not a member i'm not a united states citizen I'm i'm an american citizen which is quite different but this year's election, 2024, with Trump and Biden, um, I'm going to show you a little uh, what propaganda can do to enforce what the powers that be want you to do. So when Trump made a, a mention of what he will and will do with the United States pulling them in, in or out of NATO, and Hillary Clinton claims Trump will withdraw U.S. from NATO, if he elected, he means what he said, is to draw a public opinion of, no, we should not get out of NATO. We should we should support them. Where do they support us? Now, I'm going to tell you something about NATO that you may not know. All the countries that are in or members of NATO are corporate members, meaning NATO itself is basically a bank. Where, if you did not see, we seeing billions and billions of taxpayers' dollars, American money, to these individual entities, corporate countries. Why would you not pull out of that? Why wouldn't you want your money to be home? Why would you want to send it away? You got hungry, starved. I mean, people are getting evicted at a high rate, losing their homes. In all major cities, uh, metropolitan areas, homelessness is on a and and skyrocketing increase and rise. But yet and still, you can't help none of these people. Can't house none of these people. But you can send billions and billions of dollars to all these different countries, quote unquote allies, quote unquote money takers, because that's that's all they're there for. We fund all of these countries so when trump was in office he said these are bad deals they are bad deals